Wow. Wow, two chat. No, don't don't copy the top of the emulator, please. Hmm. Is that cutting off anything? I'll have to find out in a bit. Whoop. Whoop. All right, hang on one sec. I got a, a new fan magic, so tell me if you hear it. Anyway. Zelda 2. The Adventure of Zelda 2. I want to open my door, scared. Move the microphone a little bit, but where you couldn't hear it. Let's see, we gotta figure out the plot. After Ganon was destroyed, Impa told Link a sleeping spell was cast on Princess Zelda. She will wake only with the power of the number three Triforce sealed in the palace in Hyrule. To break the seal, the crystals must be placed in the statues in the six well-guarded palaces. Link set out on his most adventuresome quest yet. Alright. A familiar scene. No, actually, we want it to be... No, no, not that. Not st... We want Data 2 to be stream. Okay. Can't keep naming Link stream, though. No, nothing's cut off, so that's good. Anyway, we venture forth. The re wait, I forgot to check the emulator volume. Hmm. Seems an okay level, though. Okay. And now, you will notice that this ain't your grandpappy Zelda. Mostly because your grandpappy, you know, didn't really have Zelda. If you were playing this. If you were playing this when it came out, probably. Unless you are the grandpappy. Town of Ruto. Hello. Alright, good. Please let me help you. Come. Oh, so now the bot's being expedient about it. I can restore your life. Too bad I don't have any life lost for you to restore. Here's a house? Question mark? I am error. Alright, so a lot of people assume that this guy, something's up with this guy, in that, you know, his dialogue is an error message handler, or that, you know, it's a mistranslation, but actually this is the guy who had his name translated correctly. Uh, he has a friend later in the game named Bagu, who tells you to do something with air. I, I forget what. Just tell him something, maybe. But essentially, his name was supposed to be Bug. So it would have been, wait for it, Bug and Error. Find magic in a cave south of the castle. I could actually scoot the microphone. Okay, I, like I think I like that better. <clears throat> mm. 
use keys in palaces they are found in. Do not go south without a candle. Alright, so we don't have a candle, so we must not go south. Alright, and, uh... They, uh, hit me on a path. Paths are kind of the safe zone here. Alright, I forget what's in this port. Oh, it's, a, you know, a bunch of experience points to start us off. So, if anybody does not know what this game's all about, this is, like, the only Zelda game to just outright be a platformer. And in addition, uh... It has RPG elements, so I just leveled up my health, which means it's, you know, it's a little bit of a misnomer, because it's kind of more defense. Like, I take less damage from stuff the higher that is. You can also upgrade magic and attack, which I guess are pretty self-explanatory. This is a dark cave. we got to find a candle somewhere. I don't remember where the candle is. But we made it over here, and there's a palace up there, but before we go there, we want to go down here. And you might be thinking why we want to go down here. Well, be patient, you'll find out. And we must avoid the dreaded bubbles. This is one of those games. But you still got the sword beams. Alright, so... And you may ask... Dustin, what's over here? Why did we want to go here? Well... It is simple. There is a heart container. And that's like the actual health upgrade. Like we get another notch of health which I am wasting near immediately. But we gotta go back now. Oh. And I should uh, probably put something up while I'm playing this game. Uh, hang on just a minute. Yeah, there was a little too much. Chat was a little too tall anyway. Yeah, there's the screen kind of flashes when uh when Link dies, so I probably want to stick that up there. Don't know what they were thinking with that, but but yeah, like in Castlevania Ninja Guide, knock back here is kind of a thing. Okay, the desert. The desert. You can avoid those, it's just that I'm very bad and therefore it doesn't happen. Alright, so here we are. First dungeon. About as hard as it is to get to the first one in the original Zelda. There's an item in here somewhere, also like the original Zelda. The perspective's a little different, though. Alright, so already can get a level up. Uh, I will... Let's see. I think I will hold off, because I don't actually have any magic spells to use yet. 
yeah, I can. You can save your experience points for uh, the next level, so I can upgrade something else instead. Which, like I said, I currently don't have any magical spells, so that's probably what I want to do: is just put it into attack or something. You also get a free bonus level for beating the dungeon, so if you're ever close to the end of a dungeon and uh, you're close to leveling up, you might just want to do that before you leave. Okay, oh, and there are some enemies like this one that can steal experience. Uh, if you're close to the end of a dungeon and you're very close to leveling up, you may want to do that before you leave because beating the dungeon will bring you up to the next level, no matter how far you are from it. So that's good to know. And those guys are back in 2D side-scroller form. Alright, so... I can upgrade life again, which I will. Why not? Alright, no map of the dungeon, I think, unfortunately. Oh man. You can kill these guys, I think. It just takes an obscenely long time. But otherwise, I'm gonna take damage, so... At least I'm pretty sure. But my attack's not very high. You know what, let's just, uh, escape. Okay. I took a leap. The danger bridge. <laughs> yeah, but there's generally good reason to kill most of the enemies you see in this one. Crap. <laughs> Thank you. Gotta be careful not to make that mistake again. Should be good now. I'm gonna die. And here's the hammer, brother. Nah, I still don't have any use for magic. Oh god, this guy is the worst. Yeah, you're gonna be seeing this guy a few times throughout the game, this dark nut fella. Oh. And he is the worst thing in the, in the ever. Cause he just kind of likes to change where he's attacking on a t attacking on a whim, and I need a key to get through there. So I gotta come back. Also, I'm gonna be jumping a lot in this playthrough because it's it's fun. Okay, look at his silly pose. See you, suckers. And that one is so fast. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> you guys are the worst thing ever. This, this dungeon sucks. No, it's 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 a good dungeon. Oh, eh. 
gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. This game, by the way, this game has a reputation for being kind of hard. I don't, I don't know. I always kind of thought that, uh, oh, thank God. I, like, I'm kind of, kind of after playing it not too long ago. I'm thinking, I don't know, Zelda 1 might be harder, but I'm ready for the game to make me eat my words. Aha, uh -huh, but I can use my shield, too. But the problem is I also gotta hit him. Yeah, I think that's what causes the issues with this guy, is that the, the attack-defense disconnect here. Yes, more attack, please. I'm gonna die. And whatever, I'll level up magic. Oh, need a key to get through here, too. And the enemies are going to have respawned, I bet. Not, well, not the skeleton brothers. Alright, not, uh... Not the... that guy. I am... I am gonna die. What's this way? I don't remember the dungeon layouts. It's the long corridor of Jack Squat. Oh dear, oh dear. Please, uh, don't do that. Instead of doing that, don't. And then we'll just, you know, pretend as if you had done that. I'll take it. It'd be nice if that fairy would respawn, but I don't think there's gonna be any such luck. Ugh. Those guys kill me. The laughing, the laughing, the hopping guys. I don't know why I said the laughing guys. If they killed me, they'd sure be laughing, that's for sure. And I'm gonna immediately die to those anti-fairies down there. Or this one up here. Yeah, so I gotta walk back to the dungeon. Luckily it's not it's not that far away. Go on a magical adventure. I should keep the keys though. Yeah, I still got the two keys. Yeah, that guy can't get me. I see his black pixels moving across the floor. I dodged it. Alright. Alright. Alright, so now we just gotta go down to the basement. I think that's where the item is. And we're gonna want items. Oh, but... It, well, that went... There went whatever little experience I ended up having. You know, this is gonna seem like a weird statement, but Link looks especially elfy in Zelda 2. Is it just me? He looks like more elfish than usual. X-Men, welcome to die. Oh 
Okay, luckily, die was not had this time. Was this, was this the wrong place? I think it's the right place. No, this is the right place. Oh, oh well, I'm gonna die. Except I didn't. Yeah, this game, this game is fairly difficult. There's the candle. Now we can see in caves. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. I haven't ever seen these tiles used in a, in a different game before. Only in this, only in this game, never in anything else. Uh, <laughs> that guy. They put that, oh uh, god, not again, not again, not again. They put that guy on some serious roids. Like, of the stare kind, not the Himma kind. Oh wait, there's a fairy up there. I better, I better go visit, visit her, goodbye. And he, he loses interest. He's just like, eh, he's, he's on the elevator now. Ain't no use anymore. Sadly, I don't think my sword beams have any effect on this guy. Yeah, this, like, to heck with the bosses, this guy is the most, holy crap. Yeah, well, I'm gonna be getting a level up soon anyway, I just might as well level up magic. Oh no, Return of the Skeleton Brothers, though. Alright, alright, the, the Hammer Brother going partially through the door. It's like, it's just like Bowser in Mario 1. You're just, you're trying to find a good entry point here. Oh god, no. How about instead of that... Well, the thing is, like with RPGs, the more I level up, the stronger I will be. And the less of a threat these guys will pose to me. I might, I might die. I died. <laughs> well, I get to show you what the candle does now. No, actually, I, I take it back. This game is pretty hard. Alright, here's, here's the candle. See, now we can see. Uh, 
Okay, let's try that again. Nope. Nope. Go away. It's alright, this is probably not going to be a long stream. But, you know, it's been a couple days and I just felt like doing one. So... Oh, also, it doesn't seem like there's any frame drop, so it seems like this uh, DNS is about as stable as the Google one, so... It seems like we're good on that front. I mean, I goofed up and had audio desync for like the first 10-15 minutes, but... But that's just me, being an idiot. As per the norm. Nope. Nope. Oh. <clears throat> Dude, I don't know why this guy destroys my brain like like he does, but he, he just... My brain is dead when I start fighting this guy. Uh, uh. Oh, hey. The good news is, since I'm running this game at 30 frames per second, the, uh... The flashing lights are nowhere near as potent when they're visible at all. I mean, all part of my plan, seizure having viewers, epilepsy, sufferers. I did it all for you. It seems we have reached an impasse. Oh no, the seizure lights are still bad. Well, I have a warning. Please do not watch if epileptic. Like Link will die and then you will die, so please don't risk it. Yeah, it's like, uh... Yeah, those guys are, are kind of a pain. They're like, uh... Ironically, while there are Hammer Brothers in this game, they aren't actually as frustrating as Hammer Brothers. Whereas those guys more fill the, uh... The Hammer Brother elite enemy thing. They're, they're a pain is what I'm trying to get at. came through, I doubt it, but, you know. <laughs> okay, here's the boss. You can tell, because they put up curtains. Horsehead man. The Lord of Equestria. Thankfully, a boss that is actually easier to fight than those guys before. Oh, more seizure lights. I have slightly desynced the camera. Uh, I probably should have went back, killed some enemies, and then did this. As you can see, 
I now have a free level up. Oh well, I can keep it in mind for the next dungeon. Okay, now this is where I completely forget where you're supposed to go. But, unlike Zelda 1, it's like- Oh, no, I remember. Gotta go south. See, like, unlike Zelda 1, I actually have a good idea of what I'm supposed to be doing. I mean, not as good as, like, maybe a modern Zelda game, but... But point is, I have something to latch on to. But first, let's check out this town, because I don't think I have. Welcome to... Rauru. Return the crystal to the palace in Parappa, the rapper. Uh, it's not error. If all else fails, you spire. So that's two video game characters now that have told us to burn down... Burn things down. Please let me help you. Nah. Okay, uh... Only the hammer can destroy- No, not you, not you. I need to talk to the lady. Talk with my father. B. I could accidentally hit B. And yeah, we want to come here, because you'll see why. Each town has a wise man. Learn from him. And this one is this town's. A wizard! In Parapnal Desert, use this magic to survive. Shield. Which is basically a defense spell. Now I finally have something to use this magic for. And that's basically the gimmick of this one. Get candle in Parapa Palace. Don't wait. Go west. So wait, am I going south or am I going west? Um, I guess I have two options. Oh, I can't go that way at least. There's a boulder. Well, I mean, most side-scrolling Zelda things pretty much use this sprite because they're this is pretty much the only side-scrolling Zelda thing. Oh. I'm so hungry! Yeah, it takes you a little bit to see these guys in this one. And I'll showcase my magic. And I turn red, which with this outline doesn't look too great. Okay. And more cave is to be had. Oh, more boomerang guy. I almost managed to pass him there. Oh, more cave, but this time with bat. Yep. Oh, except this bat is actually a demon. Oh, oh. Well, I can't go this way. <laughs> I wish they would have told me that a couple rooms earlier. Well, back out of the cave.
I mean, there's a wise man in this town, but I don't think I can get to him yet. So. There's something in these woods, I'm pretty sure. See now, now that I've beaten Zelda 1 and gotten the Ring of Bodacia, I now wield the powerful wizard magic. It is now mine to use as I see fit. Oh. No, there's a... This isn't the way I go, but there's a thing here, and it gives me more magic. So that's good. Infernal beeping? That's a good. I mean, there's that cave up top I haven't gone to. In the desert. Oh. oh, we we are now dead in the desert. Look, I'm sorry, man. Marx is evil. He is. Yeah. Oh, well, never mind. He's the devil. Oh, there's a fairy. But I can't really get it. Mm, bat. Mm, bat. Nah, the Japanese site just says he's doing it because he's afraid of his his but he's afraid for his own skin. He's only doing it because he's looking out for number one. Okay, there's the doll thing. You gotta take that somewhere. Yeah, suck it, I'm, a, I'm on a path. You know, monsters can't attack you if you're on a path. That's why humans are obsessed with building so many of them. Stop and rest here. some kind of weird backdoor magic operation. This is error. Oh, it's a trophy? Something. This, you can jump very high. Alright, well I got the jump spell. So now I can go that way. to do this again. Oh, I got like no links. 
Oh well. May it not be said that I did not try. Binny. Oh, see ya. Gonna die, gonna die, gonna die tonight. Except not by that guy, he's already dead. Now it gives you supreme jumping powers. Oh, uh, but I can get a health refill at least. You gotta. It's weirdly touchy, but you can. You can do it. Oh no. Get me out of here. Oh, nope. Well, at least it's just the tiny guys. And then we're at the Devil's Marsh. me on the path. Uh, now I'm safe. And you can go up here. And this is where the paths meet. Except I am afraid. I am afraid for my life. So let's see, what way are we going to go? Go this way. Yeah, that was my family being very loud. Oh, oh, it's the it's the fish demons. Hey, let's save. Gotta go through the cave again. Probably won't play too much longer because I'm getting kind of tired. You know what I mean? Hitting the diagonals. Oh, yeah. You know, I'm so hungry and so on. Uh, uh. Uh. Yep, that's how you deal with that guy. I like when he throws it up and it just boops right into my shield. That's the best time. Oh, but I keep doing that. They turn around early. They should not be allowed to do that. And at variable speeds, at that. Oh. Shield magic. Okay. Now I gotta deal with the bats. Flag till Flurban Keith Urban. Ke 
E Thurban. I didn't actually need the fairy, but after this, I might. We're fighting enemies in the marsh. I like Link's waiting noise, though. <laughs> oh, I found the secret forest. Until I level up some more, I should probably be using the shield magic liberally. Was there anything here of any particular interest? I forget. No, guess not. Maybe there's like a secret, secret door somewhere. No, you don't. Oh. Magic refill. Oh. Monster refill. Mm, get hit no matter what. Thank you. Thank you, bot. Alright, there's another palace. Oh yeah, and I can use the magic and then get a refill right here. How about that? Jelly. Oh no, it's a skeleton. Except my magic didn't last as long as I hoped it would. I need to level up. Oh! Ah! Oh! Oh no, it's the flying Pegasus head. No, it's the key door. Oh, well, fighting these guys is basically useless right now. Well, let's go somewhere else. Snake Colonel, I'm in the palace. What I what I should do? Yeah, pretty much gonna have to kill Duders. I'm gonna want to get anywhere in this crazy mixed up world.
Oh, that didn't restore as much as I thought it would. Yeah, the problem is the magic only basi only lasts basically for one room, so that's a problem. Do 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 Don't know what the point of over there is. But it's over there. Oh, oh no, I did not expect death by unicorn. Oh, I probably should have grabbed that, but it's too late now. Oh no, a hammer broke. Aha! I found an entry point. Oh no. He's up. I should probably shield myself. I am... I'm dead. That was fun. That was a fun stream. I hope you enjoyed it. But it's, it's late now and I'm tired. Goodbye.